you know, we're still in the midst of planning, but we are planning the majority of our big outdoor events to come back. And that's, that includes City Fair, that includes Fleet Week, that includes the parades, uh, waterfront concerts. A tradition with more than 100 years of history is making a comeback. Opening day for Rose Festival 2022 is May 27th and it runs through June 12th. Wednesday morning, organizers emphasized the need to be flexible while planning during a pandemic with an increase in Omicron cases. We will definitely be looking at specific health and safety guidelines and protocols that are in the best interest of community health and be making decisions on what specifics those are in the planning process in the weeks and months ahead using our advisory council and health professionals guidance for sure. The last two years, organizers got creative with events like Porch Parade and Fleet Week went virtual. Now parade participants are ready for the return of spectators to the streets. Jane Claire Karen is the captain of a Mardi Gras crew in the Starlight Parade. Getting back together with like-minded people and seeing the smiles of the attendees and and the, the kids' faces lighting up as we walk by and, and send out love. For some Portlanders, the return of the Rose Festival is a hopeful sign. I absolutely will go to the festival. Yeah, I never miss it. And I hope the fireworks come back. I hope the 4th of July festivities come back. I hope the symphony plays. I hope things get back to normal. Now the Rose Festival is partnering with CARE Oregon this year and applications are out for parades. So if you're in a marching band or if you have a float, you can apply for that on the Rose Festival's website. In Portland, I'm Bryant Clerkley, KGW News.